I was just hoping it didn't come all the way down to the bottom of this. Well, good morning, good morning. It's a beautiful day, and here's my lovely wife, and she is painting good cabinets. Morning. Say good morning, Debbie. Good morning. <laughs> I'll tell you, it's always a good morning when I have her around. Okay, so she is filling all the holes right now with wood filler. Um, wood filler doesn't shrink like caulking, so we'll, we're filling all the holes with wood filler and then we'll sand it off and she'll be ready to paint. So, we have uh, this cabinet finished and our woodwork is finished all the way up to the front. You can see I put three quarter on everything here um, because I'm attaching some things. I'm, whoops, I'm attaching some some uh, hinges up here for my uh, TV because the TV will hang right there. And then down here uh, I'm going to have a continuous hinge because I have a, a long countertop that goes from here all the way over to here. And then my permanent desk will start right here and go over to the uh, uh, to the kitchen cabinets right there. And then underneath that, we'll use a, a little area of it for storage for our table. We have a table that I bought from Ikea. Cheaper than I could build it, to tell you the truth. And uh, I finished, I got to buy a little bit more, but I finished all of my uh, uh, venting for my hot water heater. And that orange looking stuff, which I will fill all that in around there, is fireproof foam. So there you go. And show us your show us your half gallon of beans there, baby. One of your yeah. displays. So there, there you go. So. And so um, up here's where my air conditioner will go. Uh, right there and then today I will finish out uh, the ceiling all the way to the front I have to do some cutting of the foam and uh, I'm not going to work on this front portion today but I am going to get the ceiling done up to the front portion Well, we rolled on some polyurethane just to see what it, the ceiling would look like, natural. And uh, we've kind of decided it's really not what we're looking for. So we're going to go ahead and blow texture on the roof and uh, paint it white. So this is, uh, we do have, have it all finished now, ready for texture and paint. But I'll have to wait for this polyurethane to dry. So tomorrow... I will uh, go ahead and texture and uh, paint the ce ceiling white. The uh, cabinets, Debbie got them all painted. And she, in fact, she's painted them, sanded them. And now she's ready to uh, put the uh, last, last coat on them. So that's nice. Um, we did make a transition here. All this front area, I have... I'll be having a hinged, hinged, uh, a hinged area right there where the TV will fold up. So I put three quarter inch plywood to the front uh, from this point right here. Uh, right there's where the desk starts and it goes back to, uh, to the kitchen cabinet. So there's a little transition right there and I think it'll look just fine by the time we sand it, hit it with some paint. Then on the other side, we have similar situation. We're hanging our uh, mini split. It goes right up here. So uh, right here's the transition. Uh, and that's where uh, the cabinets over, over the uh, sink, uh, the cabinets will come all the way to this transition right here. And... Uh, Let's see, then I still still don't have the wall up back there, uh, but that's uh, something that's going to be going on in the next day or so also.
Well, I've gotten rid of all my dogs, except just a few. <laughs> I have six puppies, and they are very noisy puppies today. My goodness. And then I have two females, uh, adults, three-year-old and a four-year-old. But other than that, all my dogs are gone. So, uh, we're really getting prepped and ready for um, going on the road. Very excited about it. I have a lot of work to do around here, putting a new roof on the house, new roof on the garage, uh, just doing some dirt work and uh, stuff around the house. But uh, I'm excited to, excited to uh, get us on the road real soon. So hey, thanks for watching.